cut the corner again. And we're up. I'm ill. Oh. Oh, fucking hell. I don't do being ill very well. I've become an even grumpier arsehole. So everyone tends to stay away from me, which I don't blame them. I don't just get a cold, I get like the snotty cold and it's like, ugh, it's fucking everywhere. I've just got piles of fucking tissue sitting around me. So I, I, I am nicely dosed up on drugs. Fuck it. All right, good evening, YouTube. <laughs> Third time I've tried to make this video now because I'm that fucking ill. I keep forgetting to turn my camera on or not plugging my mic in or... But, oh, it's fucking hell. It's just been a couple of days of just pure fucking bleh, snot and shit like that. Um, and then I got a tyre in me... Uh, a tyre in me screw. What the fuck? A screw in my tyre. Yeah, so... Um, I had to call out the AA. Um, my local shop wasn't open because their mechanic's gone ill. So I had to fucking possibly get it shipped over like 25 miles to St. Leonard's. But... Um, so it was all a bit of a palaver, the AA man turned up, pulled the screw out, and as it turned out, it was only about a four mil screw. So... I could have made that one. Um, so I had to... Um, so basically, um, it hadn't gone all the way through the tyre. Um, so... He's like, look, I could do a temporary repair, but that means I've actually got a punchier fucking tyre. Whereas at the moment, the stability of the tyre is fine as long as you don't go over, you know, my temporary re repairs is, su is suitable for 100 miles at 50 mile an hour. Whereas, what are you planning to use the bike for? I'm like, I'm going to work them back, uh, and then I'm taking it to the dealership to get them to look at it. And he's like, we'll do that, because it's probably safer on the tyre you've got than it is if I do a temporary repair. And see what they say, they might put a decent repair on it. Oh, fucking up. So now I was about to take it to the dealership and I'm, I, f I fucking just looked at my petrol tank and I'm fucking running on fumes. So I'm like, oh, for fuck's sake. So now i just got to run to the petrol station quickly. I could have gone to um, Asda, which is on the way, but I fucking... I, I don't know why. I don't like Asda fuel. I've never used it. <laughs> so I don't know why I don't like it. But I, I, I just don't, don't like it for no logical reason that I can think of. Apart from I, am a bit of a prick. So yeah, so I'm going to a quick run into the town to my regular fuel stop because I, I like my regular fuel stop, and I, I, I don't know if that's just me being weird, but I like to get my fuel from the same place. Which does sound weird. Now, now I say it out loud, it sounds weird. But before I said it out loud. It seemed totally normal. So I don't know. So maybe uh, if you guys could just fill me in on whether that's normal or weird. I, I, I don't know. I think it's normal, but it might be weird. Yeah, I don't know. So anyway, so yeah, so I'm off to get some fuel at my normal place. Yeah, it sounds weird now. Not bad. Um, 
and then I'm going to pop along to the dealership and see what they say. Now, this screw incident happened yesterday. Um, I checked the tyre this morning, I couldn't find the hole. I've, I've just actually located it and it's kind of closed up a bit. So I think they're just going to say, look mate, nothing to worry about. But I did bring the screw with me to show them. So I'm not just being a fucking knobhead. Do you know what I mean? Um, I don't know what I was fucking talking about then. Um, yeah, so I've, I've, I've brought the... the um, oh, yeah. I'm ill as well, guys. I just might, I probably haven't mentioned that yet. <laughs> I brought my screw with me so they, so they know I'm not fucking mental. Um, and I've got the report from the AA <laughs> to make sure I'm not just fucking imagining it and I was having a fucking imaginary sick episode of fucking bullshit, yeah. So yeah, so um, I'll just go and get some fuel. Oh, I can't even know if it's this fucking turning now. I'm that fucking thick. Yeah, it's this one. Wrong gear, dickhead. Oh, so yeah, fuel done. Time to um, pop along to the dealership and um, check out if I need a new front tyre. Or uh, personally, I think they'll just look at it and go, "Nah, we'll worry about it, mate." But I'd, r- I'd rather they say it than me say it. If that makes sense. Otherwise, I'm just yeah. Because personally, you know, I, I know it's not the same as a bike tyre, like a push bike tyre, but I used to ride them fuckers around on no fucking tread, do you know what I mean? So, the moment of truth is coming up. Will I need a new tyre? Or are they just going to laugh at me? We will soon find out. Stay tuned. YouTube. Oh, um, and while I'm there, um, yeah, thanks to all my subscribers. I've got um, 67. 67 fluctuating. I, I, I don't know why it fluctuates. I just... Assume people like one of my videos and see another one and go, he's a fucking idiot. Which is fair enough. I I do the same, you know. So yeah, um, but 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 thank you all of you for subscribing and commenting and 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 giving me your tips of riding because actually I'm fucking useless, guys. Um, and any tips and hints people can give me, there's never bad advice in my opinion. I might not take the advice. But that doesn't mean that it wasn't good advice. It just didn't work for me. Um, but yeah, no, so... Loved it, lots of likes, a couple of dislikes, which is all good. People don't have to like everything. This this isn't, like, you know... A world where I'm I'm, I'm, I'm going to cry myself to sleep. All right, I, I might have a couple of times. No, I didn't. I, I, I just think, you know... But again, you dislike it, say, well, actually... Uh, you swore too much and didn't get your point across. You're a bit of a prick. Fair enough. I kind of get that. Or don't. Just dislike it. It's your own personal opinion and um, you're allowed that. Um, but yeah, but I've, I've really enjoyed making them. Um, I've, I've not enjoyed the editing. <laughs> I fucking hate it. Um, but that comes in, you know... The more I do it, the quicker I get, so, so, which, which isn't quick at all, to tell you the truth. <laughs> it's, 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 I'm not really getting much quicker. But, um, yeah, so, uh, but, but I've, I've thoroughly enjoyed them, um, you know, um, yeah, so just, just keep on subscribing, liking, commenting, and, um, I'll keep on making this shit. <laughs> Because I'm having fun, and if you have fun re- watching them, then uh, it's a win-win, really. Yeah, so I'd just like to say thank you to you all, and uh, keep up the good work. And I'll try and make the videos better, I promise. <laughs> I don't know how. <laughs> and I've got a cold boot. Oh, and I've, and, and I've lost one of my toe sliders. Oh, I think it's called a toe slider. I don't know why I think it's called that. Might have been a toe slider. You know the little bits of plastic that go on your boots that kind of stop your toe sliding on the floor? That's why I think it's a toe slider. Might not even be called that. But I'm going to call it a toe slider, and for now on, it, that's what it will be called. Yeah, I've, 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 I've lost one. I, I haven't asked at work, because it could have come off at work, and I didn't want to seem complete no. Has anyone seen my toe slider? Excuse me, have, have you seen a blue bit of plastic? 
it's not my, my toes ain't getting anywhere near the floor around the corner come on knee down fucking hell you should see my fucking I was going to say my chicken breasts that's not what they're called is it <laughs> what are they called oh right there chicken strips <laughs> yeah I've just got big fucking chicken strips <laughs> yeah not chicken breasts <laughs> No one wants to see my breasts, believe me. <laughs> my little man breasts. No the fuck am I talking I don't know what I'm talking about now, I'm just fucking rambling on about man breasts. Oh fucking hell. The toe slider, that was it. You tell I'm ill. Oh, it's fucking terrible. There's people that I work with I feel sorry for, they, they fucking had a right where you commit. I'm a fucking cunt when I'm ill. And my missus, oh, she, she, she's not even talking to me at the moment because she knows what I'm like when I'm ill. She just goes, yeah, whatever, and walks away. Which is fair enough. There we go. Oh. Um, waste of time he was like no it'll be absolutely fine you're nowhere near any of the thread it's, it's, it's fine the tyre is so much thicker it'll close up absolutely fine not to worry about but I'll sell you a new tyre if you want one <laughs> I was like no you're alright <laughs> so yeah I thought it would be but better safe than sorry in these things you know what I mean um, he said the size of the screw hasn't even gone through to the banding or anything like that not an issue chill out I was like, cool. Fucking close shave. Oh. I must admit, that fucking feeling you get when you see that screw sticking out your tie, you're like, oh, fucking hell. Why me? Do you know what I mean? It's fucking, oh. It just the thought's like, oh, that means I've got a fucking, I'm not going to have a bike, I'm going to have to get a fucking another shitty CB fucking F or something like that. Like, I mean, and then it's like, oh, the relief now. I'm like, I haven't got to do anything. I haven't got to fuck off to St Leonard's. They're not gonna have my bike for the day. Yay! Woo! So yeah, relaxed and calm. Fucking cold. <laughs> <laughs>